I know I am a little bit late to the party, but I have finally updated my Sony a7 IV firmware to the latest version and decided to make this video in order to show you how the updating process is done if this is your first time. This is not a complicated process guys, the only important note which you should consider for updating the Sony a7 IV firmware is that if you are coming from the firmware version 1.01 or earlier like me, you need to first update to the firmware 1.05 and then after that you can easily update to the latest firmware version available for right now which is firmware 2.0 and it might be a newer version when you are watching this video but for now it is the firmware version 2 which is the latest version available for the Sony a7 IV. So let's go and see how is the updating process for the Sony a7 IV. So the first thing which you need to do is to check your camera's current firmware version and if you are on the firmware version 1.01 .01, like me you need to first update to the 1.05 and then you can update to the latest firmware. You just search Google for Sony a7 IV firmware update and the Sony's official website would load and here you can see the important note which says if you are on the 1.01 or earlier you need to first update to the 1.05 and then you can update to the latest version firmware which is for right now the version 2. You download these two firmwares, they are around 70 or 8, 800 megabytes and then you put your SD card in the camera and go to the format and you do a quick format here, make sure you have backed up all your photos and videos and after than that your memory card is ready to be inserted into your, into your computer and you go to copy the firmware version 1.05 and you copy it in your, into your SD card and then you put it back in your, into the camera you turn on the camera and then go to the setup option and to the version here you see the software update option which has been added and, and it's, it gives you some instructions make sure your battery is a high battery level is high because it takes around four minutes to update the body and as you see I have uh, speed up the video and now we are on the firmware version 1.05 then we, again we are going to format the SD card once again in order to copy the firmware version 2 here we put it into your uh, computer and copy the firmware version 2 and now the memory is ready to be reinserted into the camera and now we turn on the camera and again go to the setup option and then we go to the firmware versions version and you see again another software update option now we are going from the 1.05 to uh, firmware version 2 again the same process it took around four or five minutes and then the camera boots up and now we are on the latest version of the firmware which you can check here we have a version 2 Thank you so much for watching guys, if you have any problem or any questions about the updating process, please feel free to ask them in the comment sections, I will be really glad to help you. I will be seeing you in my future videos.